First, I'm gonna find the keys to the old house. And then, I'm gonna drive to Fireweed, and I'm not going to freak out. Everything's fine. Oh, right. I stashed them down here. <laughs> so that's where you've been hiding. I think I'm ready to go now. I have got to make solid plans to see the Geminids. I wonder if Tyler would want to go. Hey, I need to bring this with me to Juno. Oh, I should probably get rid of this. I mean, I can stream it anytime I want, but it makes me happy just to look at the box. I can't believe we're gonna go back to that. Probably not gonna see any stars at this time of day. to leave this room for the last time. Okay, man, I'm gonna miss that view. Hey, little guy. You're gonna be reunited with your sister soon. Oh, cool. I guess I'm totally ready to go now. Bye, Herbert. I know most of these by heart at this point. I wish I could have finished this before I left, but God, it was a slog. <sighs> Bombed I have to leave this behind, but the old house would probably collapse if I blasted this inside. Hi, Tyler. Hi. First time we see each other in 10 years, and it's hi, Tyler. Oh, sorry, I... It's fine, Allison. Hi is a good place to start. God, it's good to see you. <sighs> Likewise. You have anything else you need to get? Nope. This is it. My last 10 years in a bag. Then we should get going. We just have time to make the morning ferry. You look good in that. 
Thanks. One of my mentees designed it. That's really good. Yeah, he's so incredibly talented. I got a couple of local coffee shops to hang his art. Tyler Ronan, shaping the leaders of tomorrow. Yep, we're screwed. <laughs> so, are you gonna miss anything about this place? Honestly, people. The other residents, my mentees, my counselor, Aaron. It took me a while to fit in, but once I did, it felt like home. They made me feel safe. Safe enough to be me. That's so great. I'm really happy for you. We planning to get to Delos Crossing or push? You are welcome to walk. Nah, I'll take my chances. Need one last look or anything? Looked. Let's go. Really, I am 100% not creative enough to make that stuff up. Oh, and just last week, they had to turn the ferry around because a bear was on board. No way. Someone heard a commotion in the back of a delivery truck, so they opened it up. And there was the bear, fat and happy on a literal mountain of empty chip bags. <laughs> you go where the food is. Oh, I can relate to that. So then what happened? I'm not sure. I think they couldn't get him to leave, so they tranked him. Oh, poor buddy. Shot in the ass just for getting the munchies. Yeah, well, you know what they say. Safety first in bear country. Yeah, but prevention is best. Common sense goes a long way in keeping them from getting shot. The bear is fine, Tyler. For now. You hear they've been talking about loosening up regulations on trophy hunting again? Higher bag limits, inhumane ground traps, even bringing back hibernation hunting. What kind of asshole gets off on killing a sleeping animal? I'm not against hunting, but predators play a vital role in the health of our natural parks. What? Why are you smiling? I'm being serious. Oh, I can tell, Ranger Tyler. Not yet, but at least I got the school part out of the way. I can't believe you've got a bachelor's already. While I boast a half-completed certificate in accounting from an online college that may have stolen my credit card number. You'll figure out what you want. You have time. How are you feeling? Like I'm about to drive straight into a whiteout and my fog lights are dead. What about you? Allison? Well, zoned out there for a second. Sorry. What's up? I'm sorry, I'm just trying to wrap my head around the fact that you're right here, standing beside me, on our way to Delos. You don't have to apologize. It's a lot. Why did we take the ferry instead of the coast road? Because I didn't want to be stuck in the car with you for an extra two hours. Ha ha. <laughs> we have to take the ferry. It's the only way to reach Delos from Fireweed. I see. Well, good. I don't think my stomach could have taken two more hours of how you handle curves. I'm sorry. Do you want to take over driving when we dock? <laughs> no. You're going to have to get back behind that wheel at some point, you know. Look, I put a fireweed van nose first in a ditch. Hey, at least you missed the porcupine. I'm guessing things haven't changed much. You mean in Delos? Still the capital of East Jesus nowhere. Can't wait to get out of here.
guess that normal life you wanted didn't live up to your expectations, huh? I mean, having cable and full-time electricity was definitely a plus, but no one ever forgets anything in a small town. You get marked a weirdo, and that's it. That's your life. At least you had Michael. Yeah. I don't think I'd have survived high school without him. Bet you're gonna miss him when you move to Juno. How's he doing? Good. Good, good. Uh, but I haven't seen him much outside of work lately. He's been busy with his dance and helping his clan organize a potlatch. Is that smoke coming out of Stonehouse? Guess someone finally bought that old shack. That, or the ghosts are cozying up by the fire. Think the new owners know it's totally haunted? I'm sure Tina did her best to keep them from figuring it out. At least until the paperwork was signed. Ugh. That house always gave me the creeps. Those windows are like huge gawking eyes. Uh, you think people talk about our house this way? <laughs>